the most like like where I've really kind of like was like man this game's real right now you yeah. know was when I played Mike Mo and when I played uh, Mike Mo it was like for me it was like a serious match because right. I mean he's just like unmatched yeah and to that game to me was like like yeah, I was I was just like all right man I'm, I'm dead focused right yeah, now. yeah, yeah I'm yeah, like yeah, yeah. That's a big one. Yeah, that was a that was yeah. a big one. That was a yeah. good game. I mean, we we weathered each other down. Yeah, you know, we we did a lot. Yeah, and, that's true. And even then, I look back, I'm like, damn, I did some tricks that like, I, like I, I normally wouldn't do. Yeah, you know, did them good too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm sure with Mike Mo too. Yeah. it's like when Mike, Same way. when Mike Mo comes out, he, he he pulls a laser flip first try, and yeah. it's like, man, like that was like. That was like my 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 good game ender. That, right that there was your go the for time, the jugular, you know? and it's like, oh, what do I do now? You yeah, know? or right. like the guys when they set a trick that your that's your trick. You're like, wait, that's my trick. <laughs> I'm, I'm I'm supposed to set that trick, you know? Yeah. Uh, there's, there's things like that could kind of throw you off in yeah. the middle of the game, and then you start doubting your black <laughs> yeah. yeah, and you know what I'll see sometimes with guys, and I saw it this weekend with um, this past weekend with Cody Cepeda, who's so good, right? Battle Barrack Seven champion so good at everything and like he got kind of worn down a little bit he missed two sets you know where he had the chance to set the trick and i saw it in him where he just sort of deflated a little bit you know yeah and then he got beat yeah and that's know? heavy because yeah. it's like you really want to see those dudes like thrash yeah you know you, like, his confidence like, got like Seva seva too man oh. like he He'll literally He's a go for the throat, yeah. but like if there's like a couple little mistakes, it's, and he's thrown off, and it's yeah. like, oh damn, dude! Like, yeah. I wanted to see him go ham right now. You know? Right, and then they don't make it back. Yeah, I've seen guys do that. We're like, oh, he clearly was going to be the winner. Has and anyone then didn't ever win. rolled their ankle in the battle of the barracks game? Good question. No, that's a really good question. They've broken their boards, but never rolled an ankle. Could you imagine that, dude? <laughs> that would be <laughs> the worst. Yeah. The way that that it's set up right now is so rad. Yeah. Because, oh, thanks. Because, dude, how are you gonna determine who's gonna win this? Yeah. Like, you, it's impossible. How are you gonna determine? Yeah. It, it it could, like, just these matchups that are gonna happen, like, yeah. Once it's farther along. Yeah. Like, it's gonna be so interesting. Yeah. You know what's crazy is that everyone in like the first round, like so many kids complain on YouTube, especially in the first round, right? That all the comments are like, fucking this year, every year it's the same comments. This year fucking sucks, right? Because the first round, there's always some dud matches, right? So, but they, but they don't realize is it as like you said as it keeps going round after round it just gets better and better. This and is the better. best year of the battle at the barracks. Oh, thanks, man. I I think so too because it's also the different categories: pros versus Joes versus influencers versus icons, and that we guarantee the way that it's set up, we guaranteed a winner from each one of the categories. Yeah, yeah it's it's guaranteed to get crazy.